is as far as i'm aware almost one o'clock in the morning my watch died so i have to charge that before we begin my nose is really stuffy i just got back from visiting my parents they have a cat it's my childhood pet and uh in my early 20s i have somehow managed to develop a cat allergy up until the pandemic ironically i did not have an issue with that but now i do so whenever i go back to their house it takes about a day or so for my nose to unstuff itself i am almost certain i'm developing an asthmatic uh, reaction to said cat so that's great um but nothing too bad yet so if i keep sniffling throughout this video that is why. But without further ado, let's get into what I'm actually going to be doing in this video. If I even manage to film anything else beyond this clip, because this happened multiple times where I've gone to film all-nighters and stuff, and I just forget to film anything. And then these types of intros that I make are absolutely worthless. But I'm going to attempt it and see what happens. I got to stay up until at least like 5 or 6 in the morning, and my fiancé... He's been in a couple of my videos if you want to know who that guy is that I have apparently decided to spend the rest of my life with. He's doing a night shift at his job, so when I don't have anything to do during the day, um, I try to match my sleeping schedule with him, so that way we are able to spend more time together. In at least one clip per vlog, I always film myself making coffee. I know no one really cares that much, I personally love when coffee montages are included in vlogs. I cannot even begin to explain why. I just do. It's always so calming and everything. So yeah, about to make one of these. Furthermore, I think I'm going to be mostly working on my current writing project, Project Walker. At this point, I haven't decided if it's an adult or new adult slash YA uh, fantasy yet. Like, I don't know which category it's going to fit into genre-wise. I know it's going to be fantasy, obviously, but in terms of, like, uh, you know, spiciness and stuff like that, I have no clue at this point how much I'm going to include. And I guess I'll get into this later on in the video, but I'm in, at the point where romantic relationships aren't really a priority in this draft. It's the first one, so I have so much more to figure out as far as world building goes that romance right now is just not a primary concern. And I also don't want to force it, so if it naturally happens between certain characters, it'll happen and I'm going to leave it at that. So without further ado, I'm going to get in making my coffee so that way I don't fall asleep. We know that's going to happen, but anyways, yeah, let's get into it. Caffeine acquired. Perfect angle, you know? all the trends all right so it is 10 after one or thereabouts and i am about to start writing obviously i think i'm going to do a 20 minute sprint and then i'm gonna pick up the percy jackson book that i'm reading and do that for a little bit we'll see i'll just go based off of how i'm feeling because this isn't a full-on writing day i'm just doing whatever I can to keep myself awake and I think writing at this point in time will help with that. So we'll just see how it goes. I don't know if you guys can see there, but I got 418 words. It's almost two o'clock and I don't know, a little sad if I'm being honest, but to be fair, I don't normally do writing sprints, so 418 words is as good as it's gonna get. One of these days, I am going to get this clip filmed. I've tried to film it like at least 10 times at this point. Let's just get into the facts here. I got 418 words done within 30 minutes. For me personally, that's great. Don't normally do writing sprints, so the fact that I was able to do this at all is amazing. Part of my problem is while I'm doing writing sprints, there are pockets of time within that sprint where I'll just zone out and my brain just, it stops. It stops. It's normal for me. I probably have ADHD. I am in the middle of seeking a diagnosis. But besides the point, I <laughs> just need those moments to 
just let my brain rest within the sprint, which kind of sounds counterproductive, but 90% of the time, let's just say, uh, I can't control it. So I just got to let it happen. Also, side note, has nothing to do with the topic of this video, but for the foreseeable future, and I'm talking probably like the next year or so, this part of my hair is going to be growing back in. I shaved it back in 2020 when I was going through a bit of a episode as most of us were and I have curly hair so having it grow back in like this um it's been a tough but back on to the topic at hand this is what I mean by my brain just like stopping it's been really windy and snowy out it was thundering and lightning the power went out for like two seconds twice uh, so far and if that happens again I guess I don't really have an option other than to not vlog so who knows this may end up being futile we shall see but anyways I'm gonna get to reading some Percy Jackson I should have started reading this book like 20 minutes ago but in the time frame that it is taking for me to film this clip um <laughs> that's when I should have been reading so I'm just gonna get to that now and I'll talk to you guys later once I start writing again or after I start writing again once I'm finished you get the idea oh my god it has been so long since I've last filmed anything for this vlog it's been a few weeks at least it's March 17th now and I think I started filming this vlog at the beginning of March or the end of February I honestly cannot remember for the life of me with all of that being said a lot has changed not even a lot but like a decent amount the thing of note that really changed was some character related things uh meaning that i actually had to put two characters into one sort of yes one way i could explain it is there's character a character b character c and character d uh so we have character a and character b who are friends and we have c and d who are also friends their arcs kind of exist uh, separately um, and they all have POVs except for character B. Character B is supposed to be the bridge. Bridge is the gap between A, C, and D. And the problem is character B does not have a POV in the book so you didn't necessarily see a lot of the behind the scenes of um, these two different like groups of people forming like a group of relationship more or less and character a is supposed to form some sort of romantic if not good friendship with character c specifically so in order to make things make more sense to the reader i had to combine character a and character b so technically character b is still exists they still play a role in the story but they don't play as big of a role as they originally were supposed to. So character A, he now does all the things and takes the same actions that character B was supposed to do. That leads him to form a relationship, a better relationship uh, with character C and, and it will all make more sense as a result to the reader and to myself for that matter uh, because it just wasn't making sense. Like how is character A supposed to form any sort of relationship beyond what they already have uh, with character C if they never really interact um, outside of the workplace. So there's that. I had to change that. It didn't take too much work or not. It didn't take as much work as I originally thought it was going to and I'm really glad about that. I just had to change some names around, make note in the outline and change that around a little bit. But other than that, it really was a lot smoother of a transition. Uh, again that I thought it was going to be. So there's that. I just wanted to put that out there uh, before I made any more videos on this book because I feel like if, sorry if you can hear the noise in the background, I do not live alone. If I just like jumped into things and didn't explain it, I just feel like there'd be gaps uh, in the story. So just wanted to make sure I got that out of the way. Without further ado, I'm going to end this video now. Make sure to like, subscribe, and to do whatever the hell you want in life. Make sure to click the little bell next to the subscribe button to be notified anytime that I post. Hope you have a great day.
and your night whenever you are watching this and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!